Welcome to the Punch Video Time. Have you been wondering of how you can make your own grapple gun on scratch? Yeah, come to the right place. Because in this tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how to make a grapple gun on scratch. So, let's get scratching. First, let's make our own player. For my player, I have just made a simple kind of player and then after that I have made it to position in the correct direction which is kind of right and then I have renamed it to player next creates another sprite which is an arrow because arrows are cruel for me Okay, let's just put it right over there. Let's just shrink our top a little bit. And then the bottom a little bit. So, yeah, make it as small as you can. And then I'm just going to be shrinking this all the way down. Okay, so good. Let's first go with Oh, this sprite one. For now, let's just put the one green flag. Click hot. Okay, good. So now let's go with our player. The scripts are going to be a little long or something, but just bear with me, okay? So, when green flag click, go to front layer, go to X of zero and Y of zero. That happens. So go to front layer. Then I will want to add a forever loop with an if key space pressed. I will then put a repeat until block for mouse down. I will point towards mouse pointer. Okay, good. Then I will broadcast grapple stop. Okay, good. Now let's go to our sprite one and then add a when and receive grapple start. First, I will point in direction for the direction of clear something like that and now how to get our player draw the rope go to the bottom left of your screen and then click the add extension and then click the second one from the top extension then we have the pen extension gray first let's set the pen color to a little bit of set pen color to let's say orange set pen size to five size five size five okay it runs a little bit i know then i'll repeat until then let's put an or operator and then let's create our level oh i have i'm just going to be creating a simple level with borders around it now let's just make it go to x of zero and a y of zero so as you can see i have a simple border now and then we can put an r for our touching of the sprite 2 or we are touching the edge edge i'm going to be putting the pen down so pen down and then i'll move 15 steps 
Now in the wind green flag, click the arrow or raise all pen up. Okay. So good. We also have to let this go to so let's add a go to the player. Okay, so now after that, let's just see if it is working. Okay, now also here we will want to show, so let's put a show block in the start of a gravel start. Okay, that's much more better. Okay, so good, we are getting somewhere. Now we have one, some more things left to do. Make the player follow the rope. Yes, I know you have been waiting for this. It's in the player, so in this right one, broadcast grapple. And at the last, so broadcast grapple. And okay, and then when I receive grapple land. I can repeat until I am touching the sprite one. I will move 10 steps. And oh my god, this looks so nice. After that, we can just put a set pen color to white while we are gliding and then we can put the pen to down also at the end we can erase all there are some more things that we want to do right now also set pen size to 10 now what are these things that we still want to do well, it is that. Now, see this. Okay. It glitches. See that? It is now following our mouse pointer instead of pointing towards it. How can we stop this? Well, it's a simple way to fix but yeah, I'll move the hard way. Okay, so the reason for this to happen is that we are not putting an end to when we can grapple and when we cannot. Because of that, it is going glitching. So make a variable called can grapple click ok so on the when green flag clicks and grab go to zero and then key space pressed so let's put our key space pressed and then let's put an equals to for can grapple equals to zero then only we can do this now during this, we will set can grapple to one. Okay. Here we can also set send, set can grapple to one on this. This. Now after our prayer reaches the end, we can set can grapple to zero back again. Okay. Okay, so everything is working just that there is one thing of why is this left. So we can put, so on the star we can 
move negative 10 steps first move negative 10 steps um negative 20 steps so close negative 30 steps now it is making our player look back but you know that is not what we want so the easiest way to do this is position our player a little bit behind the center and yes it works and finally we are done with this grapple game look at all these techniques that we have learned during this game i know this game is so fun to play right i hope you liked it please subscribe and like my channel for more tutorials like this until next time the punch video time is out Woo!